Hey, welcome back guys. So today on this video, we are talking about your WordPress website and more specifically, I'm going to quickly answer a question. I keep getting a lot on my other video and that is how do you change the URL slug to one of your pages or posts in WordPress? So let's go ahead and talk about this. First off guys, real quick video, not too many steps involved. So be sure to stick around to the end of the video, but why would you want to change the URL or the slug anyways? Well, that's pretty easy. If you're running an online business, you know, that SEO is important and by updating your slug or your URL can help with that process. Whatever the case is, it's a pretty easy process. It's handled here in your WordPress dashboard. Check my video description. I'll try to leave the written instructions there as well, but I've already logged into my WordPress dashboard and this is the home screen. Now here on the home screen, if you want to go ahead and update a U, first you need to click on posts or pages, depending on which you're going to be changing the slug to. For the purpose of this video, I'm going to go ahead and check my posts. Okay. Next you want to go ahead and scroll down to the page or post that you want to change the URL slug to. So for example, this one right here, and the easiest way to change the URL or the slug is click right here when you hover over the post and click on quick edit. Okay. So here you can see the title of the post and then here is the URL slug. So you can go ahead and easily update this. So we can go ahead and maybe add in WordPress. Now, one thing I want to let you know is be careful when you're changing these URLs or slugs, cause it could cause a broken link at minimum. You want to do a 301 redirect, stick around to the end of the video and I'll quickly do a brief overview on how you would do that. So here I'm going to go ahead and copy the entire new slug and then we're going to click on update. Okay. So now if we go back into quick edit, you can see the slug has been updated. So before it said, this is a new WordPress post. Now it says this is a new WordPress post WordPress. So if somebody goes to this slug right here, it's going to be a broken link. Let me show you. So to help avoid that, what you want to do is there's a plugin that you can use called redirect or redirection. So let me click on plugins. Okay. And then click on add new plugin. And then here on the search plugins type in, okay. So here is the plugin that I use. You can see there's 2 million installations, four and a half stars. Once you have this plugin, what you want to do is over here on the left, go to tools. Okay. And then you want to go down to action. Okay. So once you do that, you can go ahead and set up a 301 redirect. So we would put in the previous URL right here, and then you want to put in the new URL right here. So this is going to be the new slug and this is going to be the old slug. Once you do that, click on add redirect. That way, if somebody goes to the previous URL or slug like this one right here, it's going to go ahead and redirect to the new one. And you can test it right here and you can see 301 to. So there you have it, guys. If you're wondering how to change the URL slug to one of your WordPress posts or pages, that's the easiest way I know how to do it. If you know an easier way, be sure to leave a comment below. Let the rest of us know how you did it. Hopefully you found that video useful. If so, click thumbs up or maybe consider subscribing to my channel and I hope to see you on the next video. Thanks again for watching.